do it. Never stop, I'll get it if I want it. Gotta ah. move to myself. Oh boy. I, promise, I, won't quit I told you they're dropping new stuff. It. All the time. The industry is blowing up. No. Welcome to Beverage Hunters. I'm Justin. I'm Nick. Guys, we got it. It's Prime Energy. Yeah, so uh, this started out as a sports line from Logan Paul. If you're not aware, if you're on the internet and you're on YouTube, you probably know who fucking Logan Paul is. Um, and KSI. And KSI. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's a dual thing with him yes. and KSI. My bad. Sorry, KSI. Sorry about that. Okay, bro. Um, uh, I'll text you and apologize. <laughs> uh, um, I have not tried the sports drinks, to be fair. Uh, have just, I. just because, again, I pretty much only drink sugar free stuff. I don't think they're sugar free. Well, Holy these shit! Are. These are sugar free. These are Maybe sugar these free. Drinks are sugar Actually, free. I think they are. Oh, I'm an that's asshole. Why, I think they that are. makes more sense, and that's kind of cool because it is supposed to be like an athletic drink, which is what bums me out about Gatorade and stuff. Because Gatorade is supposed to be an athletic drink, and it's basically Kool Aid these days. Oh man! So I, I, when I do get sports drinks, I'll get like you know the the sugar free ones. So right. anyways, I haven't tried them yet. They just launched these. These are the energy drinks. Um, Five flavors, dude. <laughs> right out of the gate. These are these are blowing up. Uh, both the I mean these are super new, but Prime as a brand is exploding like crazy. I mean it's got Logan Paul behind it, and from everything on the internet, they're supposed to be pretty good. Uh, yeah. Prime just became the official sports drink of the UFC, which is huge. That's crazy. That's crazy. I mean, they are doing a great job promoting this stuff. Yeah. And to get them already in Walmart's, Fred Meyers, like their their branding is also very simple and nice. It is. It's not like you know, you, like don't get me wrong, I love Ghost and all that stuff, it's but old. these are these are super simple, super simple product design. They're and it flashy. looks a they, little retro, just a little. retro. That's what I mean. It's just cool. simple. There's yes. not like 50 logos and textures. And it's not the cheap like stick sticker. On shit. Yeah, these like, are this nice. Is the black top is the black top. Oh, dude, that's money. <laughs> I mean, I'm yeah. a sucker for well, aesthetical stuff like that. If you have the top colored like monsters, they have sometimes they have the yep. green yep. or the white. Like I think that's that's sick. cool. It's cool. Um, I don't know what these flavors are. Justin picked these up. Um, so I'm gonna try to guess before we. Okay, you're gonna guess. I'm gonna guess. All okay. right. Pink. Okay. It's going to be one of two things. Either watermelon. Ooh, we were close. Or like a strawberry or something. But most people don't do a strawberry energy All right, drink. Try, or... try mixing those two together. Is it a strawberry watermelon? Boom. Oh, shit. Strawberry <laughs> <What>? watermelon. <laughs> He okay. literally just walked on set and I had to okay, like, okay. see these. So that's um, great. Green? So that's, that's the crazy. first flavor. That's crazy. Strawberry watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> that's so crazy. Uh, right. Green is probably uh, either, I don't, green apple would be a pretty aggressive flavor. Most companies don't touch. Final answer? My, okay, my brain's either going <laughs> something kiwi or green apple. Both wrong. It is lemon lime. Oh, lemon lime. I mean, duh. Lemon lime. Green Everybody. Lime has a lemon oh, lime. Oh, dude, so, that was in my there face. It is. Lemon lime. All right, next up. I'm assuming this is just orange, just like some something orange. Yeah, oh, one other flavor. I assume they're all double flavors. Yeah. Okay, which makes it harder. This, I didn't <laughs> know they were going to be double flavors. Okay, so. Uh, what goes good with orange, though, usually? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, orange. My, <laughs> my brain is like apricot, because we tried an apricot drink. <laughs> <laughs> right. um, I don't, is it blood orange? Mango. Mango. Okay. Orange, mango. Two orange fruits. <laughs> Here we go. All right, the red one. Um, Which is hard because usually strawberries. Yeah, is a like red, red sure, but sure. they did a pink one for strawberry. Um, I mean, is, are they just doing like, it's not just like fruit punch, is it? You guessed it. Okay. It's tropical punch. Hell yeah. <laughs> so Hell there yeah. you go. Tropical punch. Well, because I'm, I'm assuming these are flavors based on the sports drinks, and most sports drinks companies have a punch. Right. Uh, and then blue, I'm going to assume is... Blue raspberry. I'm hoping it's not like a coconut flavor. You, you nailed it again, dude. Boom! Blue raspberry. I mean, what else is going to be right. neon fucking blue? So, <laughs> first off, I mean, five flavors dropped right away. That's exciting. That's cool, for sure. It wasn't like two. Like, they were like, oh, let's test the waters with two. And then yeah. they just, you know. Well, like I said, I don't, again, I I don't know what their flavors of sports drink are, but I'm assuming they kind of nailed what they wanted for their sports drinks and then I just know. made an energy drink out Stay of it. Stay tuned. We'll come back and do the sports drinks. Yeah. And maybe they'll taste the same. Anyways, these all come in with 10 calories, 300 milligrams caffeine. Oh, wow. In a yes, 12 ouncer. I believe that is in what that is. In a 12 ouncer? Yeah. Oh, never mind. My bad. Skip that. Oh, electrolytes. 200 mils That's caffeine. still a lot, That's bro. a lot, though. That's still a lot. Zero sugar, 300 milligrams of electrolytes. So it's... Mm, the, you know, the vegan thing makes me a little vegan. nervous. I think everything says the vegan only if it's sugar-free now. I've noticed uh, that a lot. I guess no, because vegan means it doesn't it's, have, like, animal additives, which, like, there's, free. there's a lot... Oh, God. So, um, in case you're wondering. When I see <laughs> stuff like vegan or, like, plant-based, 
I immediately think, have you tried the Rocks Energy Drinks? I am not on the channel, but I have tried them. They're I actually have a couple of them. Terrible. They're not They're the Flintstones best. vitamins crushed up and mixed with water. It's yes. so gross. So I'm gonna line these up the way I think they're going to taste here. So best so you, you, is last. This is where we're gonna start. Okay, here. okay. <laughs> you okay. You don't want to do strawberry. Well, I guess it's strawberry almond, so it won't compare. Never mind. All right, so we're gonna start with lemon lime. Make sure you guys are subscribed and let us know which of these Ooh, that had is a your nice favorite flavor. Crisp pop. That did. I was just about, I was just thinking as I opened that. Okay. All right, they're not clear. Do so we that's, think that's cool? I yeah, like but I mean it's cloudy. Do we think they're gonna be colored or no? If if there's no additives, I think they're all gonna be that color. You think so? If they're vegan with no additives, because it seems like they're doing an all natural thing, yeah. they're normally clear. Does it say anything about natural colors, though? Are there colors in it? I don't see any colors with numbers, brother. Normally it'll be like red yeah. four, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so on the nose? Very lemon limey. Wow. Very lemon limey. Wow. Wonder if it smells like Sierra Mist. Sierra Mist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That story's out. That story drink is a letdown, bro. Really? My kids literally just reviewed that. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah so, I mean, so, any soda kids are like, it's right. good. <laughs> All right, let's, let's taste it. Ooh. I mean, it's not bad. It's really refreshing. It is very uh, soft. It is soft, pillowy. Yeah, I don't know how else to Feather describe pillow. it. Feather pillow. Yeah. Um, it's very. It, it does you get have both flavors. It has. Though. I'm like torn because like, it kind of has the lemon lime taste of a Sierra Mist that was opened an hour ago. Mm-hmm. But no, it also, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? It's like <laughs> like there is carbonation and it's not bad, but it's like. It's not flat, but it the flavor tastes a little flat, but at the same time, it almost tastes like a lemon-lime juice yeah. that's carbonated. Right. I don't yeah. love it, but it's not bad. It isn't bad at all. I, I like the fact you get both the lemon and the lime. You do get both in there. It's not like yeah. just a one stands out. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, Blue Raz. This one's popular. A lot of I'm drink a, companies have I'm a Blue flavor. Raspberry guy, but it's hard to nail Blue Raspberry. It is. I mean, there's a lot of different variations of it, and sometimes they're just go not too so good. They just go too hard with the sweet a lot of the times, and it's just fucking brutal. Nice crackle. Yeah, these are. Uh, so it looks like they're all gonna be that that same. I called color. it. Color. Called yeah. it. You nailed it. He's on a roll. Today. I'm on a roll today, guys. Let's get some lottery tickets after this. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Holy shit. <laughs> Whoa. That's like a blue raz sour patch kid. But it smells like it's gonna taste really good. Hmm. I like that they went with the not overpowering blue raz. Yeah, it's very. But I will say, subtle. I will say, I I still don't think I could drink a whole twelve ounce of that. It's <laughs> it's pretty. It's it's blue raz is hard to not to nail. It's one of yeah. the harder ones to nail. Like the ghost blue raz is really good, but it's really good for like two or three drinks, and then I'm like, okay. Right. <laughs> these taste, these have like a lot of weight to them. I will being say, sugar free. I, they do. They <laughs> surprisingly sweet. Is it like stevia? How's it so sweet? Sucralose. Okay, sucralose. So, uh, sucralose isn't all that good for you. So, you know, it's one of those high fructose kind of things. But I was gonna say it's better than sugar, but I guess I'd be lying to you. So. <laughs> um, that explains why it is so sweet, though. Um. I will say this isn't bad. I don't want it to. I don't want it to come off that the, the lemon lime was bad. It wasn't bad. No, I they're, they're, they're good flavors. But for being a, co a new company's first go at energy drinks, these these are better than a lot of big companies Man. when they launch energy drinks. Right. These are really good. That's what I was saying. When you drop five flavors right off, you better know those taste good. And I mean, so far these two. I mean, classic lemon lime. If you like that, you're gonna like this blue raz. It's another type of blue raz different type of a flavor, but it's still really good. I like that it's a little more on the subtle side. And they're, like I said, they're they're, they're heavy. And like there's no a heavy. And it's because they went sucralose rather than a more yeah. different sweetener. Cause I was gonna say they don't have a sugar-free aftertaste. And they are not, um, they're not over carbonated either. Give me a little bit on that one. Yeah, yeah, I'm like, not a big mango guy. <laughs> <laughs> they're not super carbonated. So when you take a drink, you're like. <laughs> it's heavy mango smell. Ooh, yeah. Wow. Big time you know what it go. smells like? It smells like, uh, is it monstered? Is there a sugar-free, like, is it the yellow monster? Or no, the yellow Red Peachy Bull. Peachy Keen from Monster? Yellow Red Bull. Oh, yes. It smells like yellow Red Bull. It does. Yeah. All right, here we go. There's the orange. 
feel like it's a lot, very orange. It is very orange, but it, but it smells like mango. It smells mango. <laughs> I, I never understand that. Something smells something and then tastes something different. I think the mango so, makes it a little tart. Again, it's not bad. It's I think if you tart. like orange stuff or if you like mango stuff, you'll be a big fan of this because they did kind of nail the combo. Uh, this is my least favorite so far, though. I'd say so. Yeah. For me, just again, well. it's not it's, bad. It's, but compared to the other two, it tastes more. It's, it's like a soda. Mm -hmm. You know what else is cool? These you don't really get that caffeine flavor. There's in no. These that's what I mean. Two hundred. There's what I mean. They don't have a chemical taste at all. Mm -hmm. They don't have a caffeine no. taste. They don't have a sugar-free taste. Very soda ass. They're good. Yeah, they're good. Very soda. They're good. All right, here we go with the <laughs> fruit tropical. I punch. I am a I'm a fruit punch guy. I get the fruit punch monster. I get the fruit punch rock star. No, like, if it's good, I love fruit punch. Yeah. There are some that, I mean, so Nos had the Kyle Busch fruit oh punch, and that was so good. Oh my god, I remember good. that. Oh. That was like the best fruit punch. Flavor. They haven't made that in a and while, right? No, they 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 came out with a different fruit punch, and it was completely different. That's a bummer, dude. <sighs> Which I actually made a video with both of those. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> it smells so good. <laughs> this is straight Kool-Aid, baby. It does smell mm -hmm. heavy Kool-Aid. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Fruit pot. Tropical. Damn it. Wow. I'm going to have to go out. That one's a little more. I need like a palate cleanser because I, I, I got like barely any flavor. <laughs> it's very light flavor, but. A little more chemical on this one. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, I agree. Um, like it tastes more artificial. I think fruit punch is one of those things that is really hard to nail without a lot of sugar. Yeah, I would because say because all so. the sugar-free other fruit punches are the same way. You get like a you get like a hint of like um, a really watered-down fruit punch, so the flavor's yeah, a lot lighter. That's what I get. Because like if you go get like down. you know a Hawaiian punch and you're like, this Dude. is delicious, but if you look at it and there's like six billion grams, of <laughs> the sugar's like this thing. Yeah. On the <laughs> They're like, they're like, okay, a teaspoon of water and a whole and bag of sugar, sugar. <laughs> syrup. <laughs> so yeah, I think this is just a hard flavor to nail with all yeah, the sugar. Yeah, I would say that's probably my least favorite out of all of them so far. It's Again, it's, just, it doesn't taste bad. It just doesn't taste like much at all. No, it's like I, I have a really weird aftertaste with this one. It, this is the only one with an aftertaste for sure. Yes, and I think we're getting the aftertaste because the flavor's not as strong. Probably, like yeah, these yeah, have yeah, a little yeah. stronger punch to the flavor, so it hides the aftertaste. Mm -hmm. So yeah, a little let down on the fruit punch. All right, the final flavor. I think I'm most excited about this Strawberry one. Strawberry watermelon, which we did one not long ago, and it was freaking amazing. Oh yeah, amazing. the Gatorade one. I bought like three of those. Since Great then. crackle. Huh. And once again, same colors. This one's just pink all of a sudden. <laughs> yeah, right. It's the only one. <laughs> if you get, if you find the pink juice, you get a million dollars. It smells Ooh. just like the Gatorade one we did. It does actually. <laughs> oh man, I'm excited. All right, the final one from Prime Energy. Let's go. Wow! Oh, wow! Um, dang it. It tastes think. like a flower. Does that make sense? It tastes like somebody just walked up to a rose and went. <laughs> 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 I don't. It's like floral. Yeah, I know. I get a little floral. Yeah, it's weird. It doesn't taste. I get a little bit of watermelon in it. I don't get much strawberry. <sighs> it's very watery. But... Um, so. I think you almost put these in the, the order, order backwards. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> best to work. Yeah. You were like, we'll, put, we'll save the best for last. And it <laughs> progressively got worse. <laughs> oh, and again, sometimes none of these, you nail it. Sometimes. And again, uh, none of these are terrible. They're not terrible. They're not terrible. Uh, the fruit punch one, I wouldn't buy. I, I wouldn't recommend the fruit punch. I don't think I would buy these two again. Honestly. Yeah, this is one of those ones where I, I wouldn't buy this, but if you walked up to me and were like, hey, I got you energy drink, I would drink this one. Oh, for sure. I would probably sip on this one so I didn't look like an asshole, but I wouldn't be pumped about it. I'd be like, fucking yeah, dude. <laughs> this is a good lemon lime. It is a good lemon lime. It's literally like a, almost like it's drinking a Sierra Mist. Yes. Like, Blue Raz is all right. God, this smells so good, but it doesn't deliver. I'm starting to get the burpees, baby. Man, yeah, it's, I'm, I was hoping that was gonna be the, the more flavor. I drink it, the more I drink it, the more I get the watermelon. But it's like again, it's like got this weird floral thing kind of going on. Contains allergen, tree nuts, coconut. 
That's weird. There's tree nuts in it. What the hell? <laughs> nuts. It's, it's probably, there's probably like a uh, one of these is like a chemical or an additive uh, or something yeah. from a tree nut, you know. Kind of oh. like a, a lot of candies have anise in it, which is like from the butt gland of a beaver. Wow. Yeah. Well. Yeah. I'm gonna have to research that and not drink those. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's like most, It's like it's like Reese's and Snickers. Like a bunch what? of those all have like it's like a secretion. Again, there's I'm sure they take that and there's some like chem they like chemically oh, cook yeah. it down to where it's not even the same thing anymore. But I, I'm pretty weird. sure that's where they get it from. Wow. Dude, there's tons of shit like that, like Skittles and what, anything. They just milk beaver ass. Anything with non-vegan <laughs> gelatin comes from like horse hooves. Yeah. They like boil yeah. out horse hooves, so it's like. But I mean, humans have been doing that for millions of years. We're just we're all soft because it's 2023. And now we'll get work weird. Back in the day, we'd just be sitting there eating horses. So right. What are you like, looking at? <laughs> this horse leg was great. <laughs> uh, all right, do this. Rate Prime as a line for energy. The whole line. The whole line? The whole line? The whole shebang. Mm, I'm torn. <sighs> These guys are doing a lot of heavy lifting. Yep. This guy's kind of middle of the road for me. Exactly. These guys are low on the road. These for are me. pulling some points off. Yeah, so I'm gonna go. They're like the black hole pulling the points away. If if one of these two were a little better, mm -hmm. I think I'd give it a seven, Ooh. seven and a half, because of how disappointing the fruit punch was and the strawberry. I'm gonna do like a six point five. Six point five on the whole prime line. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a seven three for the line. You know they're all right. They're they're. Just kind of basic flavors. Sure. Like, there's the, I, I'm sure they're gonna come out with some more. Yeah. And I think those are gonna. That one's probably gonna be a more a bigger hit. Sure. But they don't have an original flavor. Right. Like, like, there's not like this is the prime original. Like, you want this. Flavor. I think that's because again, I I don't know. I'm I'm just guessing. But I'm assuming if we were to go buy the course, because I'm pretty sure they have all these same colors. I think they literally just took like the flavor profile of the yeah. the sports drink and just like made it an energy drink. So because I mean, the sports yeah, drink is like right. like if you you know there's not like a regular Gatorade. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. So like, but kind of like Red Bull's got like regular Red Bull and flavors mm -hmm. and Monster. I because I think they just pulled over what was already popular right. from the prime. Yeah, that's so yeah. We're gonna have to get the prime hydration line and try all of those. But for now, we got these. They're all right. I suggest you give them a try. My favorite is the lemon lime. What one is your favorite? I will probably say the lemon lime as well. I do like this blue raspberry a lot, but again, it's like blue raspberry can, it's so easy to be overpowering that like the first couple of drinks, I was like, oh man, this is a good blue rasp. And then as I kept drinking, I was like, I don't know if I could drink a whole can. <laughs> right? Like, yeah, this one's easy to. Oh, I, I could smash like a easy, whole can of that. Yeah. I could smash a whole can of that. Cause again, it's like a Sierra Mist. Yeah with yeah. 200 milligrams of caffeine. <laughs> All right, well, there it is. Let us know what your favorite prime energy is down below, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.